I know you guys want to talk about money straight away, so I'm gonna skip the introduction and let's talk about Nosana AI. Let me introduce you to Nosana AI, the platform that actually lets your GPU make you money. For real, no mining, no scam, just jobs, containers and crypto. Today I'm going to show you how to connect your GPU to Nosana, how to start earning passive income and how to finally stop feeling guilty about that 4090 you bought during a temporary mental crisis and yeah for just playing games. Now you can actually earn a passive income off of it. You're welcome. So guys, what is Nosana AI? I know it sounds like a meditation app, but it's actually a GPU new work. Nosana AI is a, a decentralized compute network. Uh, basically, in, instead of big tech companies renting entire servers, farms to run software or whatever they're doing, they rent your GPU. So yeah, your GPU could work for big tech companies and yeah if you still don't know what is AI mining crypto um, I advise you to watch one of my previous videos uh, I will put a little bit a little tag here somewhere yeah whatever yeah the camera whatever it is yeah yeah um, and yeah just just to know a little bit what i'm talking about so how this works well devs need gpu power as i said and nosana connects them to random gpu owners like you and yeah you run jobs using docker container then you get paid actually in nos which is nosana native token then obviously you exchange the tokens you receive for cash, crypto or whatever. And yeah, you just start making passive income. Ah. What the fuck? Also, as a bonus, whenever you don't want to put your GPU to work, you just can use it for use you can use it for games or whatever you like to. So yeah, you can use this only when you don't need it. You just, you know, passive. So guys, how do we connect our GPU to Nosana and start earning money? Well, first of all, if you have Windows, you need to go for the setup for Windows. And if you have Ubuntu, obviously you need to go for the setup for Ubuntu. Uh, first of all, we need to, if we have Windows, we need to install Ubuntu, the version of 2022. If you have a earlier version, or for example, 2020, 2020 it's not going to work. So make sure you have or 2022 or 2024. Uh, then you need to install Docker then install the nvidia drivers and container to link obviously podman which it says and then you just use the at the end you just use the command for starting uh, the nosana grid well first of all install ubuntu is not gonna it's not a big deal you need you need just to go on your uh microsoft store and download from there very easy okay let's let's see as you see guys there is there is step by step and everything which you need to obviously copy and paste in uh, in the terminal of ubuntu which you're gonna install it uh, i want to show you guys for example Obviously, first you need to install the Docker. Installing Docker is 
very basic. Oh, my bad. Um, let me see the Docker. If I have the Docker up, so I can show you guys the the app of Docker. Yeah, one second. Let me show. So after obviously it's just like a program. You just install easy, very very easy. For example, you just need to go in on this link and then press Docker desktop for Windows. You just install it, it's gonna install it and then yeah, and then it's gonna show this page. I mean the program. One second. Yeah. So it's gonna show up this page. Obviously you just keep skip. And yeah, this is Docker. Obviously, it needs to be open when you run the jobs. And yeah, you run on Nosana, needs to be always open. Uh, something which is very important to do to make to make it work is, for example, here you need to go to resources as WSL integration, and then uh change the setting here and then press apply and restore uh, restart if you obviously you have ubuntu 22 which you need to download and you need to do this in order to uh the docker to work yeah this is one thing yeah and then it needs to be just open and then at the end you're gonna see here the container and everything so Let's go back to our um, setup uh, for Windows. After you install the Docker, you do what I said. Then, yeah, you just need to go on the Ubuntu. No big deal, right? And obviously copy some NVIDIA. Uh, this command is just to see if you have the driver or whatever. Mm, let me check one second here if it works. Yeah, for example, this is the Ubuntu uh, terminal. You just pray, you're gonna see there is the icon of Ubuntu, and you just to press it after you download it. Uh, it's gonna show up like this. Uh, for example, you, you copy the some commands, for example, as I showed before. See, so show me the command or whatever. And then you put uh, installed NVIDIA container tooling, you just copy, you just paste here, and you just put a password. Obviously, the uh, Ubuntu is not going to show up the password here, but it's writing. But that's how it is on Ubuntu. For example, I wrote it, it, it showed like it, I didn't wrote nothing, but I actually did. So I press it, I just did. Blah, 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 blah. everything here they do all the blah 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 things um and yeah and then you just need to copy step by step everything uh for example yeah then installing via counter package blah 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 you just press yes then y and configure blah 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 you need to copy all this the podman for example there is something here which for example see uh, it says oh actually it worked so the update start button yeah. okay it worked and then you check the version of it usually this doesn't work is because it is doesn't install with the command see for example exactly what i said it didn't work as you see and you need just to uh, copy this and then you press again like uh, install podman Uh, this is because I have on the same computer I have already uh, a Nosana uh, node. I cannot have you cannot have many Nosana nodes on the same computer. Obviously, that's why it doesn't work. But uh, you just need to follow the all steps and yeah very easy 
you need to follow the steps blah 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 and then the last one is, is this one which is obviously you start the job i'm going to show you guys how is my one set up and everything how, how it shows when it's working uh, but another uh, very important detail is that obviously you need uh, a, a some Solana balance in it in order them to do the transaction to sending you the NOS, the, the native token. So you need to have like, I don't know, like four five dollars in there. Four five dollars is enough for a month. So you get paid in a month to like, you know, uh, now it depends on how much you're making in a month. But as I said, you need just for the fees, a little amount of money there just for the fees when they sending you the money um, after each job you complete. Um, on top of it, uh, is on this project, you don't need to create your own Solana wallet because they creating one for your computer for example um, the, you don't you don't get paid in your personal wallet account but you get paid in uh, a, it's still your account but is made by them and obviously after you get paid uh, in that account which they give you then you obviously you you need to send them to your personal one just to be safe you know uh, in order to know where the uh, key to find the key of the wallet which they create as it shows is you need to go is to find your notes on a key navigate to this place and it's essential to back up this file to ensure its safety. It's because if you don't if you don't find this uh, file, which is the, basically the key for your wallet, you cannot enter your wallet anymore. You just lose your wallet. So this is very important. You need to save this file. And in order to find it, you just need to write this down on your uh, virtual Ubuntu. You need to go on your my computer and you're gonna see the on your my computer it's gonna it's gonna show up linux let me let me show a little bit here um, and then you need to write down like the json K JSON uh, and then it's gonna show up the actual file and in the file is gonna be like uh, loads of numbers and all of that code you need to uh, copy and put uh, import it in your phantom wallet or whatever wallet you have Solana wallet but most of them you just you should use phantom wallet which is more convenient and that's it you have your wallet you put some fee in it and yeah after you just use this command to start your job let's talk about uh, let's talk about money now One second. So how much you can earn? Let's talk about numbers. So as you as I said, Nosana jobs pay in Nosana token. Um and they paying you after each job so they don't pay you monthly or whatever they just pay you after each completed job um let's see how much you can earn which each type of different uh, gpu let me see here see it's showing here uh 
Now it depends if you have 3060, obviously it's very, very low, four cents per hour. If you have 4060, if you have 4070, uh, obviously the best is in the 5090 because it's 67 cents per hour. Obviously these other ones from the 5090 um, up, obviously these ones are very, very expensive GPUs and yeah, I don't know if some of you guys have them, but probably not. You guys probably have 3090, like the most common for uh, gaming. And yeah, it's just 20 cents, like 0 0.19 cents per hour. If you calculate that, I mean, you guys do the calculation, everything as I do. And most of the, my strategy mainly is obviously to uh, not sell the token straight away, but to wait till the tokens go up, more up or whatever, and selling strategically. But that's obviously each one of you have their own strategy and whatever you guys need the money. You're probably thinking, is this safe? Am I giving my GPU a virus? Well, uh, Nosana jobs run inside Docker, uh, as I showed you before. So they don't get access to your files and there is no shady malware or something. They cannot give you viruses or something like that uh, because they using everything, the jobs and everything on the Docker. But you need to, don't skip the instruction is very important. You need to do the step by step so everything is fine. Uh, and you can join the Nosana Discord as well and ask questions if you're confused. And be very, very careful to not DM no, and answer to any people which are not from the group chat. And even if they're from the group chat, don't you. you shouldn't never talk to them privately because most of like 99% of them they are scams so everything you talk talk over in the discord group channel and don't press any links which random people give you because you might be scammed in two seconds that's my advice so let's recap Turn your GPU into a money printing, obviously you know how now. Join the centralized compute movement, Nosana. Earn NOS, native token of Nosana, while your GPU chills. If you found this useful, smash that like button and subscribe.